can see how that can't, those wires are showing and not showing. That's the spring action inside the socket that the bulb pushes down on when you insert the bulb to twist it in. If it doesn't spring back and forth, it's not making good connection and that's why your lights won't work. You have to cut that rubber piece off right here so you can get a small screwdriver in it and just poke the screwdriver through the hole and poke it to where you feel it and push it till it stops. Once you push it till it stops, it breaks it loose and you can see the action, the spring action now. I had to do this to both of them to get the lights to work. Just thought I'd show you a little video. The pictures I show you, oops, the pictures I show you of inside the socket where the two little elements are that touch your light bulb elements. That's where your power comes in. Both of those are hot wires. One's parking lots, one's your turn signals. The ground is through the casing itself. So you can put a wire, I put a jumper on one of the mounting bolts right here and run it to the battery. And you can put your hot wire on the end of the two connectors and the lights will be on. Just thought I'd show a little video of how to do it.